hello friends welcome to my youtube channel rf design basics so in this video i will explain the inverse laplace transform of a function which need decomposition so here i am taking a function fs which is s square plus 12 by s into s plus 2 into s plus 3 so in this type of problem first of all you have to find out the poles where are the poles of this function so wherever the uh, value of this function is infinity they are poles so at s equal to 0 we have the first pole second pole is at s equal to minus 2 and third pole is at s equal to minus 3 if any of this value if you put in this function this function will be having infinite value so wherever it is infinite they are called poles so we are going to decompose this in three portion which is first portion will be a by s second will be b by s plus 2 this is second pole and third one will be c by s plus 3 so basically this function need to be written in this form so it and it must be equal to s square plus 12 divided by s into s plus 2 into s plus 3 this can be achieved by using two different methods one method is simply if we do the addition of this left side what we get is s into s plus 2 into s plus 3 and then a into s plus 2 s plus 3 multiplication which is s square plus uh, 5s plus 6 plus b into s into s plus 3 which is s square plus 3s and then plus c into s square plus 2s and this is equal to s square plus 12 divided by s into s plus 2 into s plus 3 here we can just compare the coefficient of different components like s square s and constant and we can find out a b c value so in this method we can see the coefficient of s square is a b and c so a plus b plus c must be equal to coefficient of right side which is equal to 1 then coefficient of s is 5a 3b and 2c we can write 5a plus 3b 3b and plus 2c equal to 0 because there is no s in this side so coefficient will be 0 so if we compare the constant term over here it is a into 6 there is no constant term here should be equal to 12 so 6a equal to 12 this gives that a equal to 2 so using this a equal to 2 we can find out the remaining b and c so we can write a is 2 plus b plus c equal to 1 that means b plus c equal to minus 1 here a is 2 so 10 3b plus 2c equal to minus 10 just multiply with 3 and then subtract we can get minus minus this is plus so 3b 3b cancelled 3c minus 2c is equal to c then minus 3 plus 10 which is equal to 7 so c is 7 and once we get the c b will be equal to minus c minus 1 which is equal to minus 7 minus 1 which is equal to minus 8 so we have got a equal to 2 b equal to minus 8 and c equal to 7 this is using the first method now the another method is called residual method residual method and from there we can directly find out the a b and c value so a will be equal to in residual method a will be equal to we'll put the pole pole is at s equal to 0 so s into fs at s equal to 0 
So first pole is at S equal to zero. So S into FS, so it will be S square plus 12 divided by S plus two into S plus three and replace all S with zero, which gives us 12 by six, which is equal to two. Similarly, B will be equal to S plus two into FS, which is at S equal to minus two. So it is equal to minus two square plus 12 and below we have s into s plus 3 so s is minus 2 into s plus 3 is minus 2 plus 3 1 which is equal to 4 plus 16 divided by minus 2 which is equal to minus 8 then c equal to s plus 3 into fs so s equal to minus 3 so minus 3 square plus 12 divided by s into s plus 2 so minus 3 into minus 3 plus 2 that will give you 21 divided by minus 3 and uh, minus 1 so it is 3 equal to 7 so this is called a residual method and we can get the same value of a and b and c now apply the a b c value in our expression of fs so our fs is a by s plus b by s plus 2 plus c by s plus 3 which is equal to 2 by s plus b is minus 8 by s plus 2 plus c is 7 by s plus 3 so ft will be equal to inverse laplace transform of fs so individually for 2 by s we can write 2 into ut minus 8 e to the power minus 2t ut plus 7 e to the power minus 3t ut so this is your answer so you can use any method to calculate this and you will get the same value of abc over here Thank you.